You've been cast as a villainous Bane in The Dark Knight Rises. Uh, have you managed to kick Batman's arse yet? <laughs> Ma managed to kick his arse yet? Yeah. <laughs> um, it's, it's, I, I wouldn't want to... Would, Christian Bale is not the kind of guy you want to you wanna piss off. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? so, we, we, we negotiate these fight scenes. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> so, uh, I can't answer that. Are you excited about what's going on with that franchise now, or do you do you pay attention? Or I, I don't. I'm not. I don't know enough. I don't. I've never really seen any of them beginning to end. Not for any real reason, except that you know, I don't see. A, there's a lot of movies I don't see, so I can't really comment on them. Except that what I've seen of what Chris Nolan did, did is, he's so great. You mm. know, uh, uh, he's just smart and. And, and I'm sure they're good. I don't know. But Christian Bale's like a monster. This guy's, this guy's a great actor, you know. Well, you and him have got that voice thing going on that you no, can do. No, 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 no. Let's be clear. I got the voice thing going on. <laughs> <laughs> you are amazing. Michael Keaton, thank you so much. Win Le Mans again for the Americans and for Ford. Christian Bale is, uh, I mean, I, I love your your portrayal in this movie. And it's a, it's a uh, Christian Bale is a, such a shapeshifter that he's a completely different guy almost every time yeah. you, you see him. He uh, he really is a method actor, is, is he not? Is he someone who really becomes the character because well, he has this uh, very thick British accent in the movie and he, I, I don't know if, if that's unusual to work with someone who's working that way or is no, it No, okay? some people do, and Christian is a good example of somebody, he, he'll stay in the voice and in the physicality of the character for the entire time. But he's not, like I've known his wife longer than him. I've known his wife for more than 20 years. And, it's, and so we, we would have very kind of normal conversations on set. It's just that he's speaking in that way yeah. and he's in that physicality. It's not like I say, hey, you know, how's CB doing? And he goes, I don't know who that is. I'm Ken Miles. I don't yeah, know yeah, who yeah, Christian yeah. Bale is. That would I mean, be so annoying. No, by it, the way. Would not, it, it would just mean he's crazy. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, I, I've laughed. Somebody asked him, that we were doing an interview together the other day, and somebody asked him that. And he goes, it's not, he goes, if that were the case, when I got in the car and drove away, I'd just keep going. Right. He's like, you know, we get a call sheet every day. It says, you have to show up here at 7 in the morning, and we got to start working. And he's yes. like, we know we're making a movie. It's just, that's what works for him. And, and, and you, that guy's process is clearly working well. So you can't, you know what I mean? It's like, that is absolute, it's just a kind of a practical thing for him. We I don't know where you are, Christian. You commit to your roles in ways that I can only dream of. I, I, I just, um, you, you never turn in a bad performance. It's infuriating. I wish you would. One time, just suck once. It'd be great, okay? Um, it is such an iconic role, and you're following in the footsteps of Christian Bell and Ben Affleck and even Michael Keaton. Have you received any advice from them? Uh... I, I, I saw a question doing, being asked it, and he was talking about um, needing needing a space. To, like, need, don't, he was like, figure out a way where you can have a where you can go to the bathroom. <laughs> and I was like, right, advice, advice taken. Are you ever not surprised at the level that Christian Bale goes through <laughs> to like transform himself I to mean, pull off these roles? He's amazing. It's not surprising, but it's impressive. You okay. know, I, I've come to recognize that if I'm going to be in a film with Christian, I, I'm going to have to show up, you know. I always like to show up, but when I'm in a film with him. No, I get it. So he's, No, but so it, it's it like really a, it's does. Extra, it's like a, so he's like an extra motivator. Oh, yeah. I'm completely incentivized. And especially playing a role like Lynn, I knew that I was going to have to have the confidence in the performance that you believed that she could be side by side with this man of power and you had to believe their relationship and their love story. So, I mean, I couldn't approach this with any, you know, caution, really. I had to be sort of fearless and dive in. Uh, what's your feelings on uh, Christian Bale's portrayal? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm so sorry. No, I got I got slightly misinterpreted at the last Comic Con because I actually think he's incredible. You're I think he's really <laughs> he's uh, he's kind of a definitive uh, Batman for the for the live action Batman. Um, I I you know I thought I thought I had. I think 
He's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> but I think that I think that um, uh, Michael Keaton was fantastic. Yeah. And George Clooney. I mean. Oh. Yeah, when Christian puts on that suit, it's really there. There's no added digital anything. That just looks like a movie when he's got it on. And it uh, changes in the suit, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. He, he yeah, there's some, something that's quite uh, forbidding about him when he's when he's on the set with you. Well, he looks the, he looks like a legend. He doesn't look like a person anymore. He looks like yeah. The Batman. He looks like the Batman, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And Amy has a duet with Christian. Was there you guys have worked together obviously many times before? Were there kind of keys to that to that relationship that, that Lynn and Dick had that the two of you maybe found as a shorthand or something? It's almost like the you know, there's almost a sense of, of Adam and I were talking about this, like reverse manifest destiny. Like they like rather than going out to the west, these are these are two people who said we're gonna go back east and kind of bring our power there. Was there anything that, a shorthand maybe, that you and Christian found to, to kind of click uh, these uh, relationships? I mean, I think the real gift of working, um, well, the gift of working with Christian at all, but the gift of working in, with him now three times is sort of this, um, this unspoken trust um, that I know that I have for him and, and I hope that he has with me where I so trust where he's going, and he's so um, he's so thoughtful. Everything has meaning, and so really to to just get to to be a dance partner is kind of how I think of it with Christian. Because even though um, I realized in all of the films, which is so funny, that I actually am kind of controlling him, and yet <coughs> it's true. I'm like I kind of like true. that. Um, <laughs> But as an actor, I really feel like he, um, he's the one in the lead. You know, uh, just because of how thoughtful he is and how much I've learned from him over the years, um, from the fighter to American Hustle to now, um, his commitment, his work ethic, um, everything. I just have so much respect for him and uh, how much he puts into everything. Well, we did. I love the Shakespeare scene was the one thing that we really talked about um, and worked on. I was... Um, practicing it for a while, right, on set. And I kind of thought I would challenge Christian, thinking, like, he's got to work every day. There's no way he'll win. Of, like, who's going to memorize it first? Because in the actual shooting, it was a, a fair bit longer. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I lost, of course. Never challenge Christian Bale to an acting challenge. That's what I learned. Um, but, but that thing, he, it's, I could go on and on. I just feel really fortunate to have been able to... Um, sort of dance these dances that we've had and, and I do just I feel like that uh, that's a gift to get to uh, develop a relationship with an actor over the course of a career like that. What was it like working with Bale? Good, he's a wonderful actor, he's a great actor. He was very, uh, very helpful. It's really very important that he was there to help with the hair stuff and just in general to know him, get a get a sense of what kind of person he was. I didn't do him literally, I would never attempt that, but he, there were things that, that I understood how he was, his age, where he's from, the whole, his, his uh, sentiment, feelings about things. It was really good to get to know him a little bit and um, then do the do the, the the character the way I thought it could be done. So it was it was terrific to work with him. Christian is what I call, um, and, and I mean this in the best way, the method psycho uh, actor guy. You know, so he comes, he's gained weight. He's you know he's doing the whole Daniel Day Lewis thing. You know, he's getting picked up at two in the morning. You know, and he's got kids, and he goes into hair and makeup for four hours. I think Corel does too, and I think Amy does too. I'm in the chair for, I don't know, two and a half, three hours. 
And that's a lot for me, and I'm fidgety and moving around, you know, talking to people, looking at Bush, you know. And uh, yeah, it's a lot. I don't know how, I don't know how Christian Bale's doing it. It's, he's a very patient man. Christian has, a, has an intensity uh, that is really great for Cheney. It's a very, you know, he's got a great kind of alpha male energy that um, is so good for Cheney because uh, Cheney was, you know, behind the, the shadows a little bit. You know, so it's interesting to, to cast a, a kind of an alpha male in as Cheney. I think it's a really fascinating... Uh, piece of casting. Um, and there's so many amazing people in the, the cast as well. Was there anyone in particular you were you're most looking forward to meeting? Everyone. <laughs> I mean just everyone. My first my first day that I was sitting in I was sitting in between Christian and Tom and I'm just like, oh my gosh, these guys, they're just like talent sandwich right here. <laughs> and they they're I mean like they're two of the best actors of their generation. They could possibly to be two of the best actors of all time. And I'm like, what are we going to talk about? Like, what, are we going to talk about politics or world events? Or are we going to talk about, like, the method or what's going to happen? And um, we talked about Angry Birds. Oh, really? Yeah. And they were telling me, because I never played it, and I was asking, and so they started talking about that. They liked the game, and I thought, well, maybe I should try it. Um, so it was just, in spite of the fact that these are some of the most brilliant actors ever, they're also very normal people. So mm. it was really lovely to just hear about their lives and get to know mm. them. Uh Christian and I met just to chat and said, let's find something. He's always good in everything, but... He has really matured now and come into his own and is particularly magnificent as Moses. After that, I think probably do Batman. Oh, another Batman, that's good, yeah. <laughs> Hooray! Christian Bale again. Yeah. I like Christian Bale. I like Christian Bale. I think Christian Bale is great. Do you remember when that they had that thing where they, uh, they released the tapes of him being all angry on a film set? Yeah. And he got in trouble, and I went mad. I was like, you pay this guy to be unstable and crazy, right? Yeah. And then when he's unstable and crazy, you go, oh, that's disgraceful. I yeah. mean, you pay him to be unstable yeah. and crazy. But I, I wasn't surprised at that at all, because I, I used to have a very bad temper. I don't now, right. but I used to. And I mean, what Christian did was quite pale to what I would do sometimes. <laughs> Yeah, he did about 10 minutes. I one, once did 45 minutes. Really? Yeah. But there was no one recording it. <laughs> well, I think they started and ran out of tape. <laughs> <laughs> but I think that... I think what happens, though, if you ask an actor to be all kind of, you know, keyed up and tense and you, they've been waiting around all day to be a certain yeah. way and then you kind of, you know... You know what worried me about that? What? That was a big special effects picture, right? Right. It takes ages for it to come out. Right. They recorded this during shooting, and right. the record never came on the television and the radio till the week it was being released. Yeah. Isn't that suspicious? It is. It's they almost it, as if you know? it's almost as if the studio were in some way. Exactly. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and you know what they're like? You know, I do. Yeah. They're slimy. Christian is bastards. a lovely boy. Yeah. I, 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 he is nice, Christian. Yeah. I've never yeah. met him, but I've decided he's nice. I, I, I've just, I, know, I know him very well. Take my word for it. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm, I, the, I'm his butler. I look after. I brought the boy up. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you're <laughs> 